Good morning, gentlemen. <clears throat> yeah, it was, it was cold last night, so I'm back on with my hoodie. Um, this is another Food for Thought brought to you by First Corinthians chapter 10, verse 23. I can, all things are permissible, but not all things are beneficial. Now, while well, taking my mother to work, I heard this young lady yelling at the top of her voice at the gentleman who's driving. I can do whatever I feel like. I'm like, whoa. Mind you, <clears throat> she's in three lanes over. <laughs> well, anyway, that's their relationship because it was me. I stop in the car and, and tell her, you either get out or you can take the key out and leave because you're not driving with me with that attitude. Anyway, that's me. <clears throat> I could do whatever I want. Gentlemen, don't let the devil fool you. All things are permissible, not all things are beneficial. <clears throat> you cannot do whatever you want. That's the quickest way to ruin, gentlemen. The quickest way to ruin. And that's all I heard as a child growing up. All things are permissible, but not all things are beneficial. And I was like, that encapsulates everything I was talking about that represents the foundation of the Empress Club. You must live a life of discipline and self-control. So take for example, I can eat triple chocolate cake every single day. <clears throat> That's permissible. I can do whatever I want. But you know the law of seed time and harvest. When it's time to reap my harvest, it's going to be a better one. Why? Because I cannot eat triple chocolate cake every day. And there not be dire consequences. <clears throat> now, you would think that's common sense. Now, this young girl looked to be at least 25 years old. Maybe 30. And I'm like, you almost live you almost half the years that you've been allotted on earth according to the bible which are three score and ten and you tell me it hasn't dawned on you yet that you cannot do as you feel that's a scary thought like when are you going to grow up now i believe no i could be wrong uh, not spanking children is what causes this problem. Because people think, oh, spanking child's abuse. No. You're letting your child learn early a universal law. Cause and effect. Your consequences for your actions, gentlemen. And like my principal used to say, I love her, may she rest in peace. My high school principal always say, <coughs> What you do today is going to come back and help you or haunt you. So don't be surprised in the future. Gentlemen, you can do as you want. But is it beneficial? That's all I get to see. That's my... That's food for thought, gentlemen. It shouldn't even be food for thought. That should... That, that should that should be an unspoken rule. But since you're 10 to 15, that's the target audience. <clears throat> that shouldn't even be something to talk about. Anyway, gentlemen, thank you for your time. <clears throat>